Although antibiotics have changed the way that human health care and agriculture have evolved, their excessive use in recent years, often termed misuse or described as irrational by experts, has been problematic. The emergence of antibiotic resistance is one such impact and has been described by the World Health Organization as one of the greatest threats to human health. The emergence and spread of drug resistance pathogens has accelerated. More and more essential medicines are failing. Antibiotic resistant bacteria have also become increasingly prevalent in natural environments given the widespread use of antibiotics in agriculture and livestock farming. Research on a number of organisms has indicated that wildlife serve as reservoirs of antibiotic resistance which can then be transferred back to humans. Most of these studies have relied upon single-site approaches, thus there remain many questions about the extent to which land use and landscape factors influence the prevalence of antibiotic resistance in natural environments. I will investigate this using samples collected from a network of five diverse sites in southern Europe through use of the greater flamingo as a sentinel or indicator organism. During ringing operations, I have collected samples from several hundred flamingos located in Spain, France, and Italy. By taking cloacal swabs, I will be able to assess the prevalence of antibiotic resistant bacteria in flamingos and compare this across the five sites. This will allow me to determine, with reference to the greater flamingo, the extent to which land use and landscape factors affect the prevalence of antibiotic resistance. While this will provide a good basis for investigating factors which drive variation in antibiotic resistance, I am also developing a website at which researchers can upload their own data, thus generating a meta-database. With this, links between antibiotic use and patterns of resistance at a large scale can be investigated. Show him what I got.